Designs Star with Sparkle Designs by Star. I wanted to come on here and share with you a little tutorial really quickly from my um, design ambassador, Jesse James Beads um, program mix that I got uh, for the month of October. Um, I have been sick and have not been able to post anything, so <clears throat> I'm still not completely well, but I wanted to come on here and share um, a quick tutorial real quick. Um, I will be using the um, Blackberry Baby Mini Mix from Jesse James Beads. It is the um, black and gold and silver mix. I'm going to be using um, a few beads out of here. I'm also going to be using these. I'm also going to be using these um, Cha Cha Tassels in a cloud in the sky. So we're gonna be using those. And I have pulled out the, um, this is a little bead right here. Um, it's the little bead that looks like this. I've got two of those. I also have this bead right here that's the black and um, white. I have the um, gold and black rondelles. I have two eye pins from my own stash and I also have some ear wires from my own stash. So those are the items that you'll be needing. Also um, I will leave a link down below to um, the Blackberry Baby Mini Mix and um, these tassels right here to Jesse James um, Beads. I will also leave a link for the um, design ambassador program as well. So, <clears throat> you will need some flush cutters. Um, you will need some round nose pliers. Any, any type will work. And you also need some flat nose pliers. Okay, so let's get started. First thing we're going to do is I'm going to dump everything out right here. First thing we're gonna do is we're going to attach our eye pin to our tassel. And you do that by taking your pliers and just bending that up like this. And you hook on your tassel and close it back just like that. So you have this right here, okay? And then we're gonna do the next one. Uh oh, I dropped it. And I'm trying to pick it up. Okay. We're just going to bend it out. Like I said, you always want to bend towards you or away from you. You never, you always want to bend this way. You never want to bend this way because that uh, weakens your, um, either your, um, your head pin, your eye pin, or even your jump rings. Okay. So, slip it on like this and close it back up. Just like this right here. Close it back. Okay. So, this is what we have. We have two our two tassels on. Now, we are going to, I'm going to put on this bead, this pretty black and white bead, and I'm going to put on our rondelle and this little fella. Well, that makes it look a hat. Let's see what it looks like if we put it the other way. Let's try this way. Okay, I think I like it the other way. So we're going to put the bead, the rondelle, and this little bead. I do not know what this shape is called. If y'all do, y'all can leave a down below. Okay, and we're going to fold it over. <clears throat> and I'm going to cut it off right there. And we're going to roll it up, 
close it up right there just like this okay so this is what we have okay and I need to turn it because we want it to lay right so we want it to lay right when we get our um ear wire on there so we hold this one right here and we're gonna take this our flat horse pliers we're gonna grab it and we're just gonna turn it to the side and you may have to do it a little forcefully. Okay, that should be good. So this is what we have. So then we're gonna put our ear wire on. And like I said, we open it up, we put our ear wire and close it back. So here is one earring what we have kind of looks like a little ghost doesn't it doesn't it looks like a little person okay all right we're gonna do our next one we're gonna put our bead on our rondel and our little triangle bead this one I'm gonna try to bend him over to the side and that way we can gonna measure with our other head I mean our other little part of our pen because I want to make sure whoops I did it the wrong way I want to make sure I cut it evenly so this is what I do to measure sometimes okay there we go we have that and it's over to the side so now we can take our round nose pliers and turn it and close it. Whoops, having a little trouble. There we go. And if y'all are wondering, these pliers are from Xeron. I got these um, from Amazon. I also got these from Harbor Freight. These two I got from Harbor Freight. They were not that expensive. So, if you're in the market for some tools, go to Amazon or um, Harbor Freight. And we're going to open this again. Put on our pendant we just made. And there we go. And see that one, because I did it to the side, it went perfectly. And there's our little earrings. Just like that. <clears throat> I hope y'all enjoyed this tutorial. I know it was um, short and sweet. Um, like I said, I've been sick and I didn't want to do something too elaborate right now while my voice is still cracking and going in and out. Um, uh, I will leave a link down below to the products that I used to the Jesse James Beads website. Um, I hope y'all enjoyed this video. Please give it a like, a thumbs up. Please subscribe. I'd love to have you as a member of my YouTube family. We are officially over 500 subscribers and I am so grateful to each and every one of you and to the future people that, um, join my YouTube family. And we're going to be doing some more stuff. It's just, you know, the holidays are coming up and we may be doing some different things for the holidays. So, I will see y'all next time. I hope y'all have a blessed, fabulous day. Remember, don't let anyone dull your sparkle. You were born to shine, and I love y'all. I'll see you next time. Bye.